In this video, I'm going to finish the assembly of the VEX Clawbot. Start out by creating a new assembly. Place your first component, the frame subassembly. Right mouse button, place grounded at origin. Right mouse button, OK. Reorient the assembly such that this is the front view. Like that. Open your context menu. Set current view as front. Place your next component. The right arm channel. Right mouse button, rotate on Z. I'm going to mate this to the seventh hole, to this hole, select constraint, select insert, select the outer diameter on the angle and the inside diameter, the outside diameter on the C channel, apply and cancel, rotate this just slightly. Constrain, mate, this axis to this axis, apply. Cancel. Place your next component. the left arm channel, right mouse button rotate on Z, right mouse button rotate on X, right mouse button rotate on X, I'm going to place this at the eighth hole right here. Choose constraint, insert, apply, and cancel. Rotate this just slightly. Constrain this axis to this axis, apply and cancel. Place your next component, this kept nut, right mouse button, rotate on Y. Rotate on Y a second time. Place four of the cap nuts. Constrain. Insert.
insert. Place your next component, this quarter inch long A32 screw. Constrain, insert. Constrain, insert. Place your next component, the arm subassembly. Right mouse button, rotate on Y. Right mouse button, OK. Constrain this axis to the center axis of the gear. Apply and cancel. Constrain, make this surface on the gear. With this surface on the collar. Place your next component. This shaft collar with set screw. Constrain this axis with this axis. Select this surface. and constrain it to this surface. Place your next components. The wheel subassembly. Place your next assembly, the shaft collar, and place four of those parts. Select Constrain, Insert. that diameter to this diameter, apply, and cancel.
constrain, insert, this diameter, to that diameter, apply, cancel, your wheel should look like this. I'll leave it to you to assemble the other wheels. Your final assembly with all four wheels should look like this. Go to your front view. This should be your front view. Go to your ISO. Go to iProperties and Project. Your part number should be this, 276-2600. Your description should be Top Assembly Clawbot. Change the designer to your name. Apply and close. Save your work. Save it under the name 276-2600 Top Assembly Clawbot. Go to File, Export to PDF. Submit your PDF screen capture to Canvas to complete your assignment. 